Hopefully I just don't die first. Here we go. Hey everybody, welcome to Dylan's Rolling Western for the 3DS. <laughs> it's an eShop title that I've actually had my eye on for a little while. Because I, I like the premise of it. It's kind of like a hybrid action on the ground tower defense game. Which to me sounds like it has some potential, so I'm going to check it out. Maybe I'll just do one video, maybe I'll do more, it, it really depends. Strange rock monsters are eating our scruffle hogs! Help us, rangers! Mayor Hog. Isn't that cute? Okay, Dylan, let's start with 1,000 Dylan dollars. I'm gonna call them that because I don't care if they're called that or not. That's what they're called now. Starting cash, 1,000 Dylan dollars. Cha-ching! Under the baking sun on the desert plains of the new frontier. Ah, I see there's a glitch here with the sky. Oh well. Oh, I wonder if it's supposed to look like that. One day, strange rock monsters suddenly appeared and started eating the village's livestock. Those fiends! Hearing of the settlers' plight, a wannabe ranger and his partner rushed to the wilds. A brave young armadillo with a troubled past, a past he would rather remain unknown. His name is whispered in the back streets and alleys. And that name is... The Red Flash? Is that really what his name is? Okay. That works, I guess. I thought his name was just Dylan. Howdy, I'm Russ, and this is my partner, well... I'll let him introduce himself. Dun 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 dun. Haha, <laughs> sorry. Dylan's well. How can I put this? He's the strong silent type, you see? Shoot, I don't care as long as he's a good fighter. I'm just glad you came. I'm mayor of this here village. Time's a wasting, so feast your eyes on these pictures. Our livestock are known as scruffle hogs, but we call them scrogs around here. We call the monsters that break into our village and eat the scrogs grocks. We ain't got nothing to take the market if all our scrogs get eaten. If they're nothing to sell, our businesses go bust, and that means game over. So, I want you to roll out in those plains and rustle us up some scruffles. We need them to feed the hu our hungry scrogs. What scruffles? You want us to collect them? But we're rangers, not hayseeds. We need you to fight them grog varmints too, but they only come out after sunset. Until then, collect as many scruffles as you can and head over to me. The more scruffles you collect for us, the more scrogs we can raise. I see, so if we have extra scrogs, it won't matter if a few get eaten. Kid, that's Boulder Dash. You're here to protect our scrogs. Sure, trouncing them grog varmints is dandy, but the scrogs are our lifeblood. To sweeten the pot, the more scrogs you save, the more mo reward money you'll earn. Simmer down, old timer. I get where you're coming from. You heard him, Dylan. Run up as many scrubs as you can before dusk. Take them to the mayor so we can build up the stock of scrogs in the village. Scrogs raid the village at dusk when the sky turns completely red. If all our scrogs get eaten, it'll be the end of the line for us and game over for year. We're all counting on you. We're all counting on you. Dylan, time's wasting. You need to get moving. Use your dash roll. Slide the stylus towards you and then release. Oh, this is gonna be a fun. this is gonna be one of those games, isn't it? You do exactly the same thing to accelerate. To break, touch the bottom screen and hold on until you come to a halt. Want me to explain again? No, I'm good. Okay, let's roll. Transform and roll out. Transform and roll out. There we go. Now we're talking. Oh, that's cool. My scruffles are back. 
Let's spin, 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 baby! For some reason, I'm reminded of the armadillo from Donkey Kong 64. Could be the fact that he's an armadillo. But that would just be crazy talk, wouldn't it? Oh, look, it's a rock. Oh, look, it's another rock. I found money. Isn't that just great? Gotta love the music, too. Oh, I see, a mine, huh? Ranger Scott. Mine locations change on a daily basis. If you find one, get digging at once. There we go. Haha, <laughs> there we go, just grind it. Grind it up, baby! Take this. You're no match for me, minerals. Mineral deposits. Now we're in business. Well, that's about as good as I'm gonna get, I think. Dylan, let me see you use your claw break. Just press the L button while rolling. It looks really cool. Okay. Oh, that's nice. So, that's an even faster way to stop. You know, just in case, you, in case you need to stop on a dime and whatnot. Okay, maybe I should probably get the scruffles to that guy before it goes dawn, before it goes dusk. There we go. I believe that is quite a, quite a bundle of them. Now let's go back. Or does it really matter if I go back to that guy or not? It probably does. Howdy, Ranger. Let me know if you want to sell any gems or crystals. Donate scruffles. Give. We'll be... Got it. Build up your scrog count. Thank you. We need all the scrogs we can get. Build defense gates. Trade. Hmm. Trade, huh? Sell. Sell gems. Sell it. Yes, I'm sure I want to. Blah, 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 yes. Less talky, more selly. Just sell everything, man. It doesn't matter. Yes, I'm sure. Who do you think I am? You think I'm in this to not sell everything? Because you'd be wrong. Build defense. Def okay. Maybe it would, it would help to have some defenses. Uh, okay, can't, can't build anything yet. Don't forget, Grok's raids start after dusk when the sky done turned completely red. You got it, boss. So this is the preparation phase. We have to set everything up. And of course, this is a hybrid tower defense game, so it might also help if I could build something here. I'm honestly not sure what I can build. Oh, there we go. Gun tower, huh? Yes, sir. What are your orders? Build. Wooden tower. Well, you know, that might be help. That might be helpful, right? It's also easily destroyed. Whatever, I guess it can't be helped, huh? Wow, I can't afford anything, can I? Exit the tower. You got it. Let's win this battle. So I guess... I just have to get as much stuff as physically possible until then. Such as getting these things. Let's see what I can find out here. Oh, nice. Is he building up a charge? Let's see what happens when I release. Nice. Just feels so satisfying rolling. Especially doing that. That makes it even cooler. Wow. Oh, you don't even have to be rolling to collect these freaking things, do you? All you gotta do is just walk over them. But then again, they are pretty much flowers or something. So, wouldn't surprise me. Maybe I can actually get money this way. The more hits, the more items you'll dig up. Okay. So, I just have to do weak ones. That'll get me more stuff. Here you go. 
Okay, everything appears to be going just fine so far. Unfortunately, this is a game that requires a lot of preparation, so I'm gonna I'm gonna just fast forward to the good part. Hang tight, real quick. Oh, what is this actually? Is this some kind? Of, uh, apparently, it's an ancient ruin of some kind. Oh, I get it. I gotta keep spinning. Very rapidly, it would seem. There we go. Okay, what's inside, huh? Even more treasure for me to get? Maybe this will help my efforts a little bit. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Ranger's Guide. Treasure can be found in the ancient ruins. Well, what do you know? What's in it? <laughs> I love how it's trying to be Zelda. You've got serpentine. Hooray! Cool! Well, uh, I'm just gonna fast forward again. Hang tight real quick. Uh-oh, looks like it's time now, whether I'm prepared or not. Hey, look at the sky! The village will be locked during a raid! If you've got business in the village, do it now! Oh, uh, wait, okay. Oh, okay, so it's it's not entirely it's not entirely time yet, is it? Whoa, a red scruffle, huh? What do those do? Are those extra valuable or something? Oh boy. It's about to turn completely red, isn't it? Ah oh, man, I can't even go over it. Oh luckily there's an opening over here. Otherwise that would just be annoying, wouldn't it? Well, better hurry up and get to that village. Maybe I can still make it. There we go, okay. I, I probably don't need any more scrogs. What I need is money. Got it. Sell. Heather. Here you go, Mr. Mayor. Don't take this the wrong way, Mr. Mayor. I know you can't really build up. Apparently you can't. He can't feed them to them unless I give them for free. Which is, is kind of stupid. Don't forget. Got it. I haven't forgotten. What do you think I'm doing here? I'm trying to buy some stuff so that I can prepare myself. Yes, sir. What are your orders? Equip weapon. Well, I guess... I guess a weapon is better than no weapon, right? Short range but effective against grogs that attack towers. Okay, cool. Shotgun, level one, is all set up. I'll blast them at close range. Got it. You got it, buddy. Well, at least that's relatively close to the road. So that should help with the ones that attack, or just the ones that walk by. So, you know, that ought to be good. Wonder how long it'll be until they actually start attacking. Apparently there's a den over there. Is that where they come out of? Because you would think they would come out over on that corner over there. Maybe they come out of both. Maybe the ones on the den go to the left side and the and then they've got ones in the den that go d directly down. I've got no idea how this works. I've never played this game before. I've only seen the trailer of it. Ah, okay, there's another den right here. So I was kind of right. They attack from the dens. Yeah, yeah, I got it. The Grogs are starting to raid! Oh, crud. They'll eat the Scrogs they get to the village. But if you can defeat some first, then less damage to the village means more money for you. But if all the Scrogs get eaten, then it's game over for us. Now let's show them what we're made of. You got it. Okay, hurry up. Hurry up. Why did I do this? This was not a good idea. Actually, I can start attacking them now. Oh, crud. Ah, oh, dang. This isn't good. Where are they? Where are them pole cats, huh? I better... I better hurry because there's a den over there and, uh... They're slightly closer to the village. Oh, okay. There's only one right now. Shouldn't be any trouble. At least they're shown on the map. 
Wait, di did it already get destroyed? Oh, crap. Nope, it didn't get destroyed. I wish. Oh, crud. Well, at least it's pretty far away from the village. I shouldn't have to worry about it. Hey, buddy. There, there you go. It's time to engage this guy. Defeat all Groks. Take this. Here you go. Take this. Oh, crap. <laughs> well, that's not going to work, is it? There you go. Uh, maybe it would help if I actually point at the guy. Oh, okay. I got to point away from... I got to point the touch screen away from where I'm going to be engaging them. There you go. Victory! All Crocs defeated! But that only counts as one defeat. Which means I'm going to have to keep doing that over and over again. Where do you think you're going? You freak. Get back here. Get back here, you little... You little guy. And yes, I do consider you a little guy. <laughs> Take that. Okay, that one's going to be harder to beat, isn't it? I might have to do a full charge for that one. Crud. There you go. Victory! Cause it's sweet, sweet victory! Yeah! There you go. What do you think of me now, huh? I bet you're starting to regret your decisions, aren't you? Well, unfortunately for you, I'm not just going to give you forgiveness that quickly. Especially when you're not even asking for it. I mean, come on, if you surrender now, I might actually spare you, but let's be honest, you're not, you're not gonna, you're not gonna surrender. That you things would rather die than actually admit defeat, wouldn't you? Because you're rock head. You're thick headed. You've got rock. You got rocks for heads. Oh no, protect the village. Oh crud. Crud. The other ones are getting to the village, aren't they? While I'm doing this. Unfortunately, I gotta be fast. Crud. One of the one of the made it to the village. Come on, get there as fast as you can, little guy. We can't afford to wait. Oh boy. This is bad. I knew this would be hectic. Because while you're fighting one, it gives the other one, it gives the other ones free reign to attack the village. I knew it would be hectic. Ah, crud. And of course, I might just die first. Take this. Where are you? There you go. Well, I just don't die first. Here we go. Victory! Okay. And this is just the first day. I imagine it's gonna get even harder from here. Of course, the idea is to have better defenses to help prevent this from happening in the future, but, you know. Actually, I have a shotgun over here. This should be the least of my worries. This one should be relatively safe. I should focus more on the right one. But I'm not gonna, I'm not just gonna leave them hanging. Really? Wait, what? That didn't even make any sense. Oh, it's because I, it doesn't necessarily go where you aim, he just moves. It depends on where he started, too. There you go. Die! Ah, oh, crud. Ah, oh, man, one of, the, one of the other ones made it through. Shotgun tower, what is with you? Yeesh. Oh, okay. It actually worked about to say you right because it's short range and it just it just got to the tower cool awesome so I knew I 
did that for a reason. I knew I got that shotgun tower for a reason. Of course, it's even better if you defeat them yourself because you get chips out of it. And you know, being able to buy your way to victory by getting better upgrades, you know, that's the name of the game, right? Okay, this is the last one, so. I'm, all I have to do is beat this one and we're, we win. Here you go. These, the green ones are weak. You can use, you don't even have to really charge up to beat them. There you go. But these ones are tougher. You have, to, you have to really charge up to beat them. Got it. Don't worry, I'm about to destroy them all. Oh boy. Here you go. What do you think of that? All the rocks should be destroyed now. At least for the time being. Yep, zero out of eight. Defended! Village saved! And they only got the got the extra ones, which is funny. Because I started out with ten to begin with, and then I got three more because of the scruffles. So Basically, they just shaved off the extra. Which, you know, I, I'm, I'm good with that. Finished feuding rewards? Sure, why not? How's it going, mates? You did well today. You deserve a break. Oh, you can buy gear, huh? Wait. <laughs> Drop the freaking... Buy gear. Psst. Hey, Ranger. My name's Sal, the traveling salesman. Maybe I should sound like the salesman from Resident Evil 4. You don't look like the type to pack iron. But I've got nothing but six shooters today. Hey, don't fret. I'll get a wiggle on round my usual trading routes. And find something that'll suit you just right. Just hold your horses for now. You do well to practice your skills with this equipment here. If you feel like it, just select practice skills. What are you buying? Hmm, eat dinner, huh? Replenish hearts? Mm, nah, 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 nah. I'm, I've already got my hearts almost completely full. Introducing Madam Croaky, Herbal Remedy. Hold on for just a second. Hey, can you help my boy? He's got terrible pain in his gizzard. Pa, oh, my belly hurts. If only I could get one of the medicinal herbs that grow out near the tower. But I can't leave him alone in this state. Please help my poor boy. Okay. Find the medicinal herb that grows near towers. So it's a it's a risk slash reward kind of thing because the penalty is 150, but you, you're rewarded with, you get double your money back if you can do it. Sorry. You know what? You know what? Let's just rest for now. Do you want to end the day? Yes. Well, shucks. He's not bad at being a ranger for a greenhorn. It's only because he's got such a capable partner. Ha! Huh. If you've got time to kill, how about working on the defense gates as well? What's a defense gate? They're big old gates bent, built out of ore from the mines. They stop the grocks from getting into our village. But if they take too much damage, the farmers will destroy them. Thanks for all you did today. Bed down for the night, and I'll see you tomorrow. Got it. Should be fun, right? In fact, I already got enough money to at least build a gun on the other side. Do you want to continue playing? Yes, I do. You kidding me? Yeah, good morning, Dylan. I heard ta tell the Grocks raid a village for three days in a row. And their raids get stronger by the day. So we need to arm, arm more and more towers with weapons. Ranger's, is, Ranger's Guide. Not all towers can be equipped with weapons. Yeah, I got it. So, I've already got a shotgun tower, but maybe I can equip something else. Actually, this would be a good. Yeah, J just grab the ground, pal. Enter the gun tower. First, I want you to build it. Well, I have to build it first, don't I? Uh, iron tower, much more durable. Unfortunately, the unfortunate part about that is I probably won't be able to afford any weapons for it once I actually do this. Huh, the tower is very expensive, but very durable. Maybe I'll do another wooden tower for now. Because it doesn't seem like that there was any trouble with their actual durability. 
Ah, crud. And yet I still can't afford any of the good stuff. Dang. This is this is very unfortunate. Huh. Interesting. But wait. Wait a minute. So it can only protect over there? It can't protect its own lane for that? Well, that's kind of stupid, but whatever. Get, just get another shotgun. That, that'll work, right? Yeah, two shotguns ought to work. As long as there aren't any long-ranged ones, they should be just fine. Presumably. I mean, they destroyed the weaker ones without a problem. So I don't think I have anything to worry about until it actually gets later on in the game. Okay, any damage? Nope, no damage whatsoever. That's what I thought. Those weak ones, they don't really do anything. I can let the towers take care of the weak ones, and any, any of the ones that are actually strong enough to be a threat, well, I can take care of them myself. That's the way this rolls. There you go. Can I go into the ancient ruins again? Or is that just a one-time thing? Nope, it's just a one-time thing. That's too bad. Here, I was hoping I would actually be able to, you know, have another one ready. I guess that's not gonna happen, is it? Well, at least I'm finding money. That's right. Let's swim in the cash. What do we have here? Is that another mine? Yep, it's another mine. Let's go mining for ore. Huh. Apparently there's a rock in here. For some reason. There you go, buddy. Apparently this one's being guarded. Not very well, presumably. There you go. It'd be nice if there was a way to tell how close it is to dusk. There probably is, I'm just not... I'm just not looking for it. There you go. Not too bad, not too bad. Oh, okay. Status? Ah, oh, that's cool. Look at that. Art pieces, of course. It's pretty much just like Zelda, isn't it? Let's see, items, quests. No quests, cool. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, apparently there's another one that I didn't even see. Whoa. Wait a minute. Yeah. Hold your horses. You almost went right past one of them. There we go. Everything's going good now. Or well enough anyway. Ah, there we go. 50 coins. Not too bad. Especially for just a rock. Wow, it is hard to, to navigate when you're rolling like that. That's probably the trade-off, isn't it? Indeed it is. The more speed you have, the less control you have, obviously. It's just like a, a vehicle in a racing game. So in addition to being like a tower defense and action game, it's even got mechanics like a racing game. You know, to a little bit of an extent. It's like a jack of all trades, isn't it? It's a good thing those mines give out huge beacons. No idea how they do that, but, you know. There you go. Take that, you little weirdo. You will give me your minerals. We must mine more minerals. We require more minerals. I'm sorry. Oh, nice. A pebble bubble. Yeah, yeah, collecting pebbles. Yeah, that'll help me. That'll help me when the grogs start attacking. Yep. Let me tell you about it. What are you doing? Are you just flying up there? Without a care in the world? I hope you're at least the one showing me where the map is and showing me where the locations are and keeping me up to speed on where they're actually located at, the enemies and whatnot. Because otherwise, I can't imagine you're doing all that much, are you? There we go. Okay, let's go. Let's go do something anyway. 
Yeah, yeah, I got it. Oh, okay, nice. Fill the gauge to complete the gate. What do I need? You really want to use your, your ore to build the gate? Yeah. You got it, man. Okay, 48%, not bad. So, I've, I've got some kind of defense here. Hopefully. But wait, it says none. Why, why is that? Okay, may as well sell that. It, it gets a decent amount of money. Ugh. Just, <laughs> may as well be... Yep, that, that pretty much is just rocks, isn't it? I love how he can't... You have to donate them in order to, for it to actually go to the scrog count. Because, you know, it's not like they can actually pay you for your work. Because why would we do that? Why would we actually pay you for your work? Don't forget, Grok Raid, start after dusk. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Well, it's a pretty fun game so far. I'm not sure if I'll be doing another one. I guess that really depends on you guys. Do you guys want to see me do more? If you do, give this video a like. You know, comment below. Especially, that would that would probably help even more than, than just liking it. But, you know, liking it helps too. But anyway, that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like mind beacons. And I will see you next time. So go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.